So super middleweight contender George Groves has said he is rival in boxing James DeGale, who is the IBF super middleweight champion, hasn't got long left in boxing and he's on the slide of his career and that he's only fighting now to cash out in big fights and he's only got a couple of them fights left in him. And in so many words, this is true because James DeGale has said it himself in so many words. He has said, look, I'm 31 years old. I'm not going to be in boxing for too many more years. I'm looking to have a few big fights, making some money so I'm comfortable, winning some more titles and then retiring. So I kind of believe Groves in this, but I don't believe the girl was on the slide. I just think against Badu Jack, he had a hard, grueling fight. Like, fighters are going to have them kind of fights in their careers, unless you're somebody like Floyd Mayweather. You're always going to come against someone who's going to be competitive and tough and you're going to have to rule it out with them and James the girl showed a lot of heart in this fight like he got up off the floor in the final round he knocked Badu Jack down in the fight himself so yeah I don't think he's on the slider but I do believe that he won't be around in the sport for too many more years and he'll have a few big fights and then call it a day George Groves on the other hand is looking to fight Fedor Chudinov for the WBA super title at super middleweight. He's looking to get a deal ironed out soon by his promoters, Cowley Island. So, yeah, that's what I see on this. I see Groves and DeGale fighting again at some point in the future, if it's this year or next year. I see them fighting again. Them two are always destined to have two fights or even three fights, people thought, but they're definitely going to have a rematch. The first fight they had was a great fight five, six years ago. It was a fantastic fight, which George Groves won by majority decision. There's definite bad blood between the two. They don't like each other. And I look forward to seeing that fight if it's ever made again because you just know it's just going to be a bad blood fight and you just know it's just going to be an entertaining fight. So, yeah, that's all i got to say on the situation. JM Sweetboxing.